everyone! Welcome to my channel, English Bites. Ngayon, ang ituturo ko sa inyo ay ang complete conjugation of the verb do, yung basic form at progressive forms. Kasama na yung emphatic forms, katulad ng present emphatic, past emphatic, at yung mga emphatic questions. But before that, if you are new in this channel, please don't forget to like, subscribe, click the notification bell in order to be updated, at siyempre, share na rin para mas maraming matuto. In the conjugation of verbs, we are going to divide this into three parts. Yung first person, second person, at third person. Sa first person, ito yung nagsasalita. Second person, ito yung kausap. At third person, ito naman yung pinag-uusapan. Now, first singular. I do. Example, I do my homework every night. Second person, you do. Example, you do your job well. Third person, he does. Example, he pag lalaki, she pag babae, it naman kapag bagay o hayop. Example, he does his work every day. Now sa plural. Ang subject ay plural, so we ang gagamitin natin. We do. Example, we do our homework every night. Second person, you do. Example, you do your obligation well. Third person, ito ay plural na, marami, kaya ang subject natin ay they. So, mayiging they do. Example, they do their work every day. Past tense singular. I did. I did my assignment last night. Second person, you did. Example, you did your obligation well. Third person, he did. Example, he paglalaki, she pagbabae, it naman pagbagay o hayop. He did his job well done. Pagbabae, she did her job. Ang his ay magiging her. Pagbagay naman, it did its, ito ay magiging its, it did its job well. Next, past tense plural. We did. We did our assignment last night. Second person, you did. Example, you did your obligation well. Third person, they did. Ex example, they did their job well. Next, future tense singular. I will do. Example, I will do that tomorrow. Second person, you will do. Example, you will do this next week. Third person, singular, he will do. Example, he or she or it will do. Pag he, he will do his job. Pag babae, she will do her part next month. Pag lalaki, I mean pag bagay, it will do its. Ito ay magiging its part next, next time. Again, he pag lalaki, she pag babae, it pag bagay. Example, he will do his part next month. Pag babae, she will do her part next month. At pag bagay naman, it will do its part next time. Next, future tense plural. First person, we will do. Example, we will do that tomorrow. Second person, you will do. Example, you will do this next week. Third person, they will do. Example, they will do their part next month. Next, present perfect tense singular. I have done. Example, I have done the impossible. Second person, you have done. Example, you have done the right thing. Third person, he has done. Pagbabae, she has done. Pagbagay, Ohio, it has done. Example, he has done the right move. Next, present perfect tense plural. First person, we have done. Example, we have done the impossible. Second person, you have done. Example, you have done the right thing. Third person, they have done. Example, they have done the right move. Next, present perfect tense singular. Example, first person, I have done. Example, I have done the impossible. Second person, you have done. Example, you have done the right thing. Third person, he had done, or she had done, it had done. Example, it had done the right move. Or pag lalaki naman, he had done the right move. Pag babae, she had done the right move. 
Next, past perfect tense plural. We have done, that is your first person. Example, we have done the impossible. Second person, you had done. Example, you had done the right thing. Third person, they had done. Example, they had done the right move. Future perfect tense, singular. First person, I will have done. Example, I will have done this before you arrive tomorrow. Second person, you will have done. Example, you will have done it before lunch today. Third person, he, she, or it will have done. He will have done this by the time we arrive tomorrow. Or she will have done this by the time she arrives tomorrow. Or it will have done this by the time we arrive tomorrow. Next, plural, future perfect tense. We will have done. Example, we will have done this before you arrive tomorrow. Second person, you will have done. Example, you will have done it before noon today. Third person, they will have done. Example, they will have done this by the time they arrive tomorrow. Next, present progressive tense singular. First person, I am doing. Example, I am doing this for you. Second person, you are doing. Example, you are doing this for your future. Third person, he or it is doing. Example, he is doing something or she is doing something or it is doing something. Hmm. Past progressive tense plural. First person, we were doing. Example, we were doing something for you. Second person, you were doing. Example, you were doing an important job. Third person, they were doing. Example, they were doing something secret. Now for the future progressive tense singular. First person, I will be doing. Example, I will be doing something for you. Second person, you will be doing. Example, you will be doing an important job. Third person, he will be doing or she will be doing or it will be doing. Example, he will be doing something important. Next, future progressive tense plural. First person, we will be doing. Example, we will be doing something for you. Second person, you will be doing. Example, you will be doing an important job. Third person, they will be doing. Example, they will be doing something important. Next, present perfect progressive tense singular. First person, I have been doing. Example, I will have been doing this for you. Second person, you will have been doing. Example, you will have been doing an important job for five years. Third person, he will have been doing. Example, he will have been doing something important for three days. Present perfect progressive tense plural. First person, we will have been doing. Example, we will have been doing this for you. Second person, you will have been doing. Example, you will have been doing an important job for a decade. Third person, they will have been doing. Example, they will have been doing something important for one year already. Next, past perfect progressive tense singular. First person, I had been doing. Example, I had been doing this since yesterday. Second person, you had been doing. Example, you had been doing an important job since last year. Third person, he had been doing. Example, he had been doing odd jobs since the beginning. Next, past perfect progressive tense plural. Now, this is a past pa, perfect progressive tense. Ang gagamitin ay had been. First person, we had been doing. Example, we had been doing this since yesterday. Second person, you had been doing. Example, you had been doing an important job since last year. Third person, they had been doing. 
Example, they had been doing odd jobs since the beginning. Next, future perfect progressive tense singular, first person. Uh, dito naman sa future perfect, ang gagamitin na nating verb dito ay will have been. First person, I will have been doing. Example, I will have been doing this by the time you arrive tomorrow. Second person, you will have been doing. Example, you will have been doing an important job by June next year. Third person, he will have been doing. Example, he will have been doing difficult tasks by December next year. Next, sa present empathic form na tayo. Dito, ang gagamitin natin ay uh, present emphatic form. Mauna ang ating subject na I sa first person. I do believe. Example, I do believe him. Second person, you do agree. Example, you do agree with him. Third person, alright, sa third person, ang do ay magiging does. He does agree. Example, he does agree with the judge. Now notice here, pag gumamit tayo ng does, Dito sa main verb, ay hindi na tayo pwedeng maglagay dagdag ng S. Dito lang sa das ang merong S, sa agree ay wala na. Okay, next. Present emphatic form plural. First person. We do believe. Pag positive, pag negative naman ay we don't believe. Example, we do believe him. O pag negative, we don't believe him. Second person, you do agree. Sa negative, you don't agree. Example, you do agree with them or you don't agree with them. By the way, itong don't ay contracted form ito ng donut. Pinag-isa lang ito, pero ito actually ay dalawang words, do at saka not. Okay, so yan ay magiging pagkumpleto, ito ay magiging you do not agree with them. Oh, okay. Now, third person, they do agree or they don't agree pag negative. Example, they do agree with the judge. Pag negative naman, they don't agree with the judge. Pag gusto mong kompletohin, they do not agree with the judge. Next, sa present emphatic question, uh, singular. Dito sa emphatic question, mauna ang ating verb na do at susunod lang ang ating subject na I. First person, do I believe? Pag negative, do I not believe? Pag second person, do you believe? Pag negative, don't you believe? Third person, ang do ay magiging does? Does he believe? Or pag negative, doesn't he believe? O kung gusto mong kompleto itong doesn't, does not he believe? Okay. Next, sa present emphatic question, plural. Ang I ay magiging we kasi nasa plural form na tayo. Do we believe? Pag negative, do we not believe? Pag, o oh, dito naman sa do we not believe, pwede rin natin paiklian ito. Magiging don't we believe. Second person, do you believe? Or don't you believe? Pag pinaiklim ang donut, ito ay magiging don't you believe. Pag gusto mong kompletuhin, ito may higin two words, do not you believe. Third person, do they believe? Pag negative naman, don't they believe? Next, sa past emphatic form, singular. Ang do ay magiging de kasi nasa past emphatic na tayo. Just like this. I did believe him. Pag negative naman, I didn't believe him. Or, I did not believe her. Second person, you did believe him. Or, you didn't believe him. Kung gusto mong kompletuhin, you did not believe him. Third person, he did believe her. Or, pag negative, he didn't believe her. Kung gusto mong kompletuhin itong didn't, magiging, he did not believe her. Next, sa past emphatic form, plural. We did believe him. Pag negative, we didn't believe her. Pag gusto mong kompletuhin ito, we did not believe her. Second person, you, you did believe him. Pag negative, you didn't believe him. Or, you did not believe him. 
pag third person naman, they did believe us. Or, they, did, they didn't believe us. Kung gusto mo kumplituhin, they did not believe us. Alright, if you have learned something in this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, click the notification bell in order to be updated, at syempre, share na rin para mas maraming matuto. Thank you very much for watching. See you again.